Hello everybody, um, I am back with another video. Um, today I wanted to show you, it's like kind of a haul slash like cool things I've like gotten in the past few months that I wanted to show you guys. Some of, some of it's like a haul, I have a couple stuff from Five Below and Bath and Body Works, I got a couple of new things and I got like a couple of like miscellaneous items I guess if you want to say. And I wanted to show you them today in like kind of like a haul. I don't know, we'll, we'll call it a haul, even though it's kind of part haul, kind of part I received some of the stuff for Christmas, so yeah, I don't you know, I'm doing, showing you guys stuff that I received for Christmas, and uh, it's the last day of July. Yeah, alright, anyway, <laughs> so, excuse me, Um, I think we should get started here. So, one of the cool things that I actually, you know what, um, let's start with the haul first. Um, I went to Five Below like two days ago I got only two things and actually they're both um I'll show you what I got now one thing you guys don't know about me that I haven't showed you yet is I like d doing um word search puzzles so I got two word search puzzle books and they have 250 puzzles in them all different themes um like like they have like um like the locks of Scotland and like flower flower emblem emblems around the world. There's like all kinds of different themes. Like this one's like three letter words and like romantic stuff and like plays or some romantic plays. Uh, there's like C worthy words. They all begin with like S E A in this one. And this one's basically the same book, it's just different puzzles. They all have 250 puzzles in them. Um, so yeah, I like actually doing word seeks, um, you know, just to like pass the time. They're actually like really fun to do, so I don't know if any of you guys like doing word search puzzles, but these books will keep you entertained for hours. Trust me, there's so many, like, different puzzles in them, so yeah, there's that. I'll throw the bag away. Um, <clears throat> I have another, like, word search book up here. Alright, so, um, back to Bath and Body Works. I got a few, um, items, actually. Sorry, I'm going out of camera. I'm, like, trying to film, like, horizontal mode this time because people have told me, sorry, there is, like, something, like, itching in the back of my head right now, and it literally did not start until I started filming this video. But, um, anyway, so, I wanted to show you the stuff I got from Bath and Body Works. I got most of the stuff a few days ago, but two of the things I got about a month ago, like I said, I've just been... Haven't had the time to sit my little butt down and film. But anyway, we are going... Oh, that's just like... What is that symbol? Oh, huh, I've never seen that symbol on my phone before. It's like a little man with a speaker. Oh, well. Anyway, um, so what I was going to show you was... um, The things I got last month were these. I got the new Wild Sand and Endless Sea Mini Body Mists. These actually are supposed to be worn together, but I like wearing them separately, but they both smell really good together. I will say they do pair really good, and, um, yeah. So, Endless Sea. I actually do not have the keynotes on this because the keynotes are not on this. It just says, made with plastic, not tested on animals, and it is not made without parabens, and there's the ingredients on the back. Um, I love this one. This one's very summery. It's very, like, aquatic, watery, like, manly type scent. I would say it's a unisex scent, which means, when I say that word, I mean, like, both, um, genders probably could wear this. It's very, like, um, you can see both genders. Ruins. It's actually more kind of, like, I could not, I could, uh, would not be surprised if they made this, like, a uh, men's scent. Like in the men's body care line, I could see this in that. Because it's very cologne-y, it's like <clears throat> earthy, like watery scent. And then Wild Sand, which by the way, the packaging is really, uh, I don't know if you guys can see that. The light might be glaring. Um, I really need to like film in like natural light and daytime. I don't know why I choose to film when it's nighttime, but who knows. Anyway... And this one is more, like, coconutty, beachy, so, like, if you, like, you see why they go together, because this one's the water, this one's, like, beachy, coconut, like, them together is really good. 
Um, yeah, so this one's good. These actually are out now, I believe. Like, I think, what's today, Monday, right? Yeah, I believe, uh, I know we're already getting ready for fall, so I don't know when the fall stuff's coming out, but it's going to be soon, and I'm going to be getting my hands on some of those fall stuff. As a matter of fact, these pocket backs, I'm about to show you, some of them are fall already, so... These, I would definitely recommend Endless Sea and Wild Sand. They do go well together, and they also go well uh, individually. So, that's that. I don't know if I showed you guys this, but I also got a Sunshine. I've been using this. I got a Sunshine and Lemons Antibacterial Moisturizing Hand Sanitizer. And if you guys don't know what these do, allow me to demonstrate. They like So, they go on like um, a lotion like that, but if you rub it in, it's actually a hand sanitizer. It's a really neat concept. And Sunshine and Lemons is one of my favorite hand sanitizer fragrances. I love it. I get it every time. Very lemony. Mm. It's very citrusy, very lemony. It smells, definitely smells really good for summer. I cannot believe that tomorrow is August 1st, you guys. Like, summer needs to, like, hold on. I'm falling here. Summer does not, I don't want summer to end, you guys. I love summer. It's my favorite uh, season. My next favorite season is fall. And then... I obviously hate winter. I think most people do not like winter. I mean, I'm a big fan of Christmas, but not, like, cold, snowy weather. And then spring is iffy where I live, so. Yeah, but I just wanted to show you guys that. I don't know if I've ever shown you guys that before, but if I have, oh, well, you got, you got to see it again. All right, so I got a candle. Um, I got this for 75% off, you guys. I got this for, like, 7 bucks and some change. Wow, that uh, lid is very glaring, so I'm going to... Take the lid off, actually. Oh, um, I probably should tell you what the, uh, scent is. This one is Watermelon and Wild Mint. 75% off. I got this for, like, 7 bucks and some change. Like, that is an amazing deal, in my opinion. So, um, I'm gonna see if I can, like, make this, like, a little bit clearer. There we go. Hopefully that's better. But Watermelon and Wild Mint. I love the, it has, like, a palm leaf on it. Mmm, this one is so good. I cannot wait to burn this one. Um, it is wild watermelon, spearmint leaves, and crisp cucumber. Hmm. Oh, you know what? That's probably why this one kind of reminded me a little bit of cucumber melon. I didn't realize it was cucumber in this until just now. Yeah, it definitely is watermelony. It's like, it's watermelon with like a hint of mint. It smells actually like a refreshing drink. Like, I could see this as like a beverage, like a watermelon mint beverage that actually would be really refreshing like i wonder if people like make that like i'm sure somewhere someone somewhere can make that or something like maybe make like a watermelon mint smoothie <gasps> that would be so good you guys yeah but it's definitely like that it's it's definitely like watermelon lemonade with like it without the lemon but it's like replaced with mint and there's a little bit of cucumber in it so we all love that watermelon and wild mint there's that i'm gonna put this on my bed because it actually goes i don't know if you guys can see that clock back there i'm kind of pointing to it there you go that clock back there actually is i got that for christmas too so i put my candles on that all right anyway we are almost nine minutes in and we're not even near done so i need to get uh talking so this video is not too long um i got seven pocket backs i got lakeside life some of them are new for fall this one smells very, like, manly again, that cologne aquatic smell. I got blackberry ba and basil. This one's good, too. This one's, like, very blackberry with, like, a little bit of, like, herbs in it, which would be the basil. Blue skies and sunshine. I think everybody likes when it's sunny out. This one actually smells very similar, if not identical, to Lakeside Life, in my opinion. This, I don't know why. I get the same smell from these two, so I don't I don't know. Uh, iced lemon pound cake. This one's yummy. It smells like a lemon cake. Mmm, yummy. That one's good. Pear vanilla. Let me tell you guys something about pear vanilla. This is the most unique combination ever. Mmm, it's like, it's pears. It's like, the, it smells like those, like, canned pears. With, like, vanilla ice cream on it. Like, that's what I get. So, I mean, that's a really good combination. I definitely recommend it. Iced dragon fruit tea. This one smells like... This one smells to me like sweet tea. 
And then this one is Champagne Apple and Honey. This is like my all-time fall favorite. Actually, I second that. Leaves is my all-time fall favorite. This one's my second. Yep, just how I remember it. Okay, so I have two more things to show you guys. One of the things I received for Christmas this last year, I know, guys. I'm, like, horrible with, like, lagging and stuff. And, like, lagging on and all that. But anyway, I got one of these things for Christmas. And another thing I got for my birthday, actually. So, one of the things I got for... The thing I got for Christmas is this cute waffle maker, you guys. It's a mini waffle maker. It's a gingerbread man waffle maker. Now, if you guys don't know, I'm not going to open the box and get it out um, right now, but it's a 4-inch four inch cooking surface, non-stick, and a 350-watt waffle maker. It says the Mini Maker's non-stick surface heats quickly and evenly for perfect results every time. Whip up tasty holiday-themed snacks for the whole family with our included recipe guide. Ooh, maybe I need to open the box. Ugh, I don't know if I want to open the box or not. Oh, well. Wintry Wonderland with a gingerbread plate. Each waffle is delicious and ready to decorate. The gumdrop buttons are not included. Well, thanks for letting me know that. And the nonstick surface is made without PFOA, whatever that is, um, and makes cleaning up easy. Yeah, I, this is, um, see, you can tell it's from Christmas because there's literally a piece of wrapping paper on it that I did not get off until now. <laughs> um, anyway, yeah, apparently, like, it says that they're ready to decorate, which the waffles, they look like this. Um, they come out like that, but they're actually more of like a pancake-y, pancake -y texture. I think I made that word up, pancake -y. but it comes like out more like a pancake, actually. It's not crunchy like a waffle. I've tried waffles in these waffle makers. They are really good, but I just like want to warn you if you're expecting like a crispy waffle, they're like soft waffles. They're like... I don't know. I don't want to say they're soggy waffles, but they're, like, soft waffles. They're, they're more like pancakes, so, anyway. But I do love this thing, and I don't know why I haven't opened it. I'll probably have to open it up this Christmas or the holidays, because it is gingerbread theme, and I think it would be weird to make gingerbread waffles in the middle of summer. So, yeah. And the last thing I want to show you guys is this Reed Diffuser white tea and ginger and i told you guys how much i love white tea and ginger smelling things and i have opened this i have not used it but it comes with um <clears throat> i'm actually not sure how to use this all it says is constant fragrance white tea and ginger reed diffuser there's like nothing else on the box it comes with Every diffuser provides clean water to places that need it most. Oh, this is like some right tea and ginger, natural rattan reeds handmade in the USA. Huh. Anyway, I think what you do is you stick the sticks in this thing, and it gives off like a fragrance like through your room, which like I said, white tea and ginger is like a good choice for me. Um, I believe I can open this and smell it. Yeah, it smells like white tea and ginger from Bath and Body Works, like, exactly identical to it, which I love that. And then you, these sticks you put in the, um, the oils, and it'll give off a fragrance. So, yeah, that's cool. I just wanted to show you guys that. Um, throw all this garbage away and stuff on my, I, my area is like a mess right now, like, it's not even funny, but anyway. Um... And then, yeah. So, that is all I have to show you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'm sorry if I'm squinting. Like, I'm, like, really tired right now. But I'm still filming this. So, I'm trying, like, actually, like, not, you know, snooze while I'm filming. But anyway, um, I hope to see you guys in the next video. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video so much. Um, if you did, be sure to subscribe if you like this kind of content. Give a like, thumbs up, and comment down below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye, everybody.